Hello everybody, John Fisher here from Jayco. I do the uh, product development for all the lightweight products. So Whitehawk, Jayfeather, the Jayfeather Micro. Today we're gonna show you uh, the all new 32 QBH, which is the bunkhouse version of our ever popular 32 RL that's been out for a few years. So we'll take you inside in a minute and show you the coach. Just a couple things, it is right at about 37 feet, 11 inches. So it's one of our larger double slide Whitehawks, has a UVW of 8,165 pounds. And one thing to note, this is kind of a, uh, a design criteria within our product team. We always try to maximize window sizes, as you can see here from the exterior views, but you're always out here camping with your family and making memories we don't skimp on the awnings. So we always try to have uh, a maximized awning size. So when we design a unit that has a campsite slide out, we usually will add two awnings. So you have over 20 foot of awning space. So um, we're gonna take you inside now and show you some of the all new features of this, uh, of this new model. So we're here in the front of the coach of the new Whitehawk 32 QBH. And as you can see, one of the popular items that we've had uh, for the last five, six model years is the front windshield, which people do love that when the when the roller shade is open and you're laying in bed, you can actually look up and see the stars at night. So it's a really cool feature that we've had and, and our retail customers have really liked. Has a 60 by 80 residential queen bed, but you can upgrade in this model to a, to a king bed. Now, upgrading to the king obviously gives you the extra sleeping surface or area but it does shorten these by about six inches on each side. So the nice thing about that though, is with the design of our bathroom, we were able to add a really nice uh, additional wardrobe with two smaller his and her drawers and two larger his and her drawers. Now we're in the bathroom of the well-appointed 32 QBH. So there's a, there's a lot of storage in this area and it starts with a nice size roomy shower with a, a glass accordion door and then you also have a nice size medicine cabinet you got storage underneath the sink and this comes equipped over the toilet there's a uh, a, a linen for towels and things and you've got a nice size linen closet and cubby space down here and all white hawks have a porcelain foot flush toilet one thing to mention is that with this bathroom you know again when we were up in the front of the bedroom, it allows for that extra storage. So that extra wardrobe and four drawers with this design. So we did work it into as many 2023 Whitehawk designs as we could, like the 27RK, for instance, uh, has the same bathroom configuration. Now we're in the main living area of the 32 QBH. As you can see, it's got an island of kitchen. So we got opposing slides with your dinette sofa over here, and then your, your galley or kitchen area on this slide. Nice size mirror and some wainscoting look really gives it a, a high-end residential feel. And there's a lot of storage in this unit. You know, you, first of all, you've got the double bowl uh, overly large stainless steel sink with pull-out sprayer. You've got two really nice cabinet drawers under here and a trash can will fit. And then you've got two deep drawers right here in the island. Fit pots and pans and all kinds of stuff. All White Hawks come with a 12 volt, 10 cubic foot refrigerator. We got some additional pantry storage here and a couple of more deep sized drawers. This one even has a drawer within the drawer so you can put silverware and other things in there your oven, microwave, and a large uh, deep additional pots and pan drawer with a full cabinet storage here. Um, one other cool thing with this is, you know, all Whitehawks come standard with the electric fireplace. So when you are at the campsite, maybe it's not a really cold day, so you don't need to run the LP furnace. You can turn on the electric fireplace. It'll, it'll definitely take the chill off the coach with 5,000 BTUs of heat. And this thing is pretty cool. You've got your 50 inch smart TV on an electric lift. And with the TV going back or recessing into this, uh, into this lower cabinet, one thing that's nice is the 32 QBH offers a ton of countertop space. So not only here in the slide out, but as well as your island, ton of countertop space. 
again, we like to maximize our window size. So the other cool thing with, with not putting the TV in the cabinet and recessing it into the, uh, into this lower area is we've got, you know, a large window there. Now we're on the campsite side of the coach. And while you have a standard booth dinette with this model, but you can have a few other options too. You can put a freestanding table and chairs, or you can put uh, two chairs along with the freestanding table. And then you'd have an ottoman here that uh, basically can seat two, but it has additional storage underneath. So a lot of our retail customers really like that, uh, like that option. Over here, we've got a trifold sofa that is standard in this model, which gives additional sleeping for you know up to two adults. Um, but if you'd like, you can uh, option in the theater seating. So it gives you the two recliners and it also comes uh, standard with our table trays that uh, consumers have really liked. And then uh, one other nice thing we've got, a couple overheads, a little more countertop space here, along with an extra drawer, 110 outlet and USB charging as well for your phone, throw your keys up there. The 32 QBH also has a very cool uh, rear bunkhouse for the kids. So they've got a, a sofa area here, jackknife sofa that can make into additional sleeping, but we've got definitely four sleeping areas, but could be five because when we stand up and jackknife the sofa, you might be able to get two small kids there. There's a nice four door cabinet here where kids could put their duffel bags or their camping uh, accessories. We've got a nice two by four folding table underneath with a couple more drawers set up the table to play games or even dine back here. And another nice thing is each one of the bunks has USB and uh, 110 volt uh, resets so they can charge, plug in their games and stuff like that. And then new for 2023 on not all, but a lot of our models in Feather and Hawk, we have the stowaway ladder that one of our design engineers uh, came up with. And it's kind of cool because the little ones can get up here to the top bunk but then we just go ahead and stow it away when not in use, so it's out of the way. And then one other really neat feature with this model, and this is the same bunkhouse rear that's on our J Feather 30 QB, uh, is it has the cargo door here. So a nice thing about that is, you know, you can basically store a lot of stuff in, in transit to the campsite or, or your destination. So just wanted to show you here this, this 32 QBH. Again, that's just rolling out to dealer's lots. And again, it's kind of the bunkhouse version of the 32 RL, which has done really well for us. Um, we're excited to hear what the feedback is from our dealers and our retail customers. And thank you for your time today.